boys and girls, welcome to Storytime with Teacher Linda. Today I'm going to read you an awesome story. It's called Penny the Pinkest Polar Bear by Sarah Phillips. Penny the Pinkest Polar Bear Penny's a friendly polar bear. But she is very, very shy. She stammers as she says her name and often starts to cry. She blushes pink from head to toe and can't think what to say. Who wants to play with a pink bear? So she usually runs away. Oh no, poor Penny. You need to keep your throat warm with something woolly and thick, says Dan. My bark is always clear. The scarf will do the trick. Now let's stretch and twist our necks and try some short, sharp sounds. So they cough and bark and stand up tall and wind their heads around. Look how silly they are. Later on, Cool Cat comes sauntering down the street. Penny runs up to say hello, but stammers and retreats. Oh, poor Penny. Look how scared she looks. Cool Cat's shocked but understands. She knows what to do. Come and drink my special milk. It'll soothe your throat for you. Penny and Cool Cat sip the milk warmed and mixed with honey. They even try some singing. But Dan doesn't find that funny. The hills are alive. Oh, they don't sing very well. As Penny runs back through the park, she meets the treetop twins. Hi, I'm Papa. She stammers before escaping to the swings. The treetop twins know how to help, they say. We have no doubt if you learn to say our tongue twisters, it will sort your stammering out. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. If Stew chews shoes, should Stew choose whose shoes to chew? Wayne went to Wales to watch the walruses. She sells seashells on the seashore. Oh my goodness. Those are serious tongue twisters, guys. Just then, the traveling pigs arrived with big bags of and balls. Hi, I'm, I'm P -p -p Penny cries before her tears begin to fall. The kind pigs say, let's all have some fun. We'll dance and sing together and join the others later on. Look how happy Penny looks. Pink is the perfect colour. That's what they both say. Enjoy the fact that you turn pink and hope it stays that way. As the moon shines in the sky and stars start to twinkle, the hushed friends inside the tent hear silver bells that tinkle.
in comes Penny, dressed in pink. She does a dance and sings. I'm Penny, the pinkest polar bear. I want to say these things. You're very welcome to the show. We hope you enjoy it all. There's dancing, music, acrobatics, and a very special ball. My goodness, when Penny sings, she doesn't get shy. Nor does she stammer. Penny sits down, pink as pink, and smiles at all her friends. She's wowed by the amazing acts and loves the mice at the end. Mice. Wow. Penny is walking home with Dan. They're dancing as they go. Pink is the perfect colour. I want everyone to know. Don't be cross with how you are. Enjoy yourself and see that the more you gain in confidence, the happier you'll be. Wow, those are true words, guys. Love yourself the way you are. Don't worry what other people say. The end. And that's it for us today. I hope you enjoyed the story. Bye.